Hey, hey, what's going on, everybody? It's me, Foreman. Welcome to a Rigs of Rods video. You may have seen some videos about Rigs of Rods posted on my channel, and I have a little something for you today. See how smooth my wheel is turning? Well, let's just say I have a controller that is usable with Rigs of Rods version 0 0.4.0.7. 0 .7. Yes, I have upgraded. So let's get to it. Let's start our engine, too. Oh, forgot parking brake. Now, this controller setup works perfectly. The only flaw I find it with this controller setup is that if I, like, watch, if I move my joy, one of my, my left analog stick for steering to the left, see how fast it turns? That's my one problem with it. I, w I wish there was a way you could just, you could just turn it to the left and it would go slow like this to simulate a real driving. Just like in, um, rig, no, not rig the rods, just like in Euro Truck. But without further ado, let's get started. We are driving a Gavril. Let me see what Gavril this is first. Oh, it's the Gavril MV4. So, today we're going to be cruising around Mitt City while I'm talking about a few things. First of all, I've moved from screen recorders from screencast to uh to open broadcaster software. Because I've found that when I made my crash test videos those videos will those videos were a much higher quality and they were in 60 FPS thanks to the 60 FPS YouTube feature I believe this video will be get, will be getting in that range pretty quickly um and this video may be out on the 9th of, Nove 9th of November if it's out on the 8th of November th then I managed to get it uploaded tonight if you're watching this at a later date then don't never never mind what I just said so as you can see my controller is working perfectly I'm able to keep a constant rate of speed I would have controller cam up, but all my ports are being used and my headset has a good quality and I do not want to um, get rid of that quality now let's just floor it down here since I have good steering let's floor it and see what happens steady steady keep the wheel steady keep it steady 100 whoa 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 we can't have any more like the steering on this is so sensitive and oh geez oh geez whoa oh oof that's gotta hurt right there no really that has got to hurt right there let's reset it I have not found the reset button on my controller oh well there goes the mintness of that mintness of that bumper. Can I hop it? Fail. Oh, oh wait a second. Wait, if I reset right there, yeah, that's what the key. Let's go pull in and grab some fuel. We're going to need some fuel. So, like I said, move the screen recorders from Screencast-O-Matic to Open Broadcaster Software. The reasoning for that is, like I said, much higher quality and the fact that it can get up to 60 FPS on YouTube. And I can also record and live stream at the same time. So, yeah, GG for that. Alright, we're fueled up. Take off parking brake, get back in cab. So, I do have another vehicle we're going to test out in this video. And you guys are going to like this thing. I don't know if it's a band mod or something. I just came across it on the Rigs of Rods repository a few days ago. So I'm pretty sure it's not going to be banned. And by the way, guys, 
If you guys would like to download these cars, links will be in the description to this MV4. It's actually an MV4 pack that Gabester made. And a and the other car which we're gonna test today. So let's park this. I will need to use my mouse. Oh yeah, that's another reason why I don't have controller cam on today. The I need a I need to use the mouse to select vehicles from the drop down menu. And you can already see it right there. You can already see it. That's right. It's a Metro D bus. Let me just do control one real quick. 18P Pentagon. Now, only I'll keep this. I'll be quiet for a little bit so you can hear the engine. The engine sound is amazing. So yeah, I'll, I'll be a bit quiet for you guys so you can hear the engine. Now, I don't know if that sounds realistic or not. I'm sure some of you guys could let me know in the comments below. Oh yeah, this is also part of a new series I'll be posting up on my channel. I'll just call it Rigs of Rods for now. Alright, let's uh, speed up. That sound is realistic, and if you could tell, if I move my camera to the left, the sound changes. It changes from my left speaker on my headset to my right speaker. Let's drive in cab. This is what the cab view looks like. It's pretty interesting. And all the vehicles I'm going to be testing in this series, they will have movable steering wheels. So if you're wondering about that, then... Go ahead. Also, if the audio is a bit too loud, like my mic is a bit too loud, I'll I'll remember for the next video, which will be recorded immediately after this video, to adjust my audio levels in open broadcaster software, because I'm pretty sure it's going to be overpowering this game sound anyway. Yeah, let's go this way. I was having second thoughts about taking this route, but... Hey, there's... Oh, yeah, and I just realized. Let me just turn on my blinker real quick to indicate that I'm turning. You may be able to already see it. Actually, no. You can't see what I'm going to show you. At the end of this road, there's, like, something special that I want to show you so let's follow this road oh yep now you guys can see it I'm gonna, once I get to the, actually, there we go, so, it is a McDonald's, and pretty much, pretty much this is a McDonald's, we got some hungry customers we're gonna drop off here. And I know the best place to park, since... Alright, so now control 2 and 4. Now, the problem I got with this bus is these doors, unlike those doors, I wish these doors were the same were the, as those doors, because if, if you can tell, I can't really zoom in anymore. 
If you can tell, these doors, they're having a bit of an issue st opening all the way. See, watch what happens. Nope, wrong one. See, they close just fine, but when they open, they don't stay open. And now what I think they're supposed to do is they're supposed to open and then fold together, but that's not happening. Oh yeah, and you could also get away with that. So yeah, guys, that pretty much does it for this episode of Rigs of Rods. Um, I don't know what else to say about Rigs of Rods. It is an amazing simulation game. If you want to destroy cars like we did in this video, there is a link to the content page. There will also be a link to the forum where you can get version 0.4.0.7 if I can find it but yeah guys I would like to thank you all for watching and I will see you all next time for another episode of Rigs of Rods I just noticed that says I just noticed before we go one last thing before we go, I just noticed, I'll bet you can notice this too, there's a McDonald's, Mitt Donald's? What? Yeah, version 4.0, I just noticed that. So anyways guys, thank you for watching and I will see you next time.